Patricia threw an elegant gentleman's dinner party uh, to celebrate the heir to the Ravenel throne. But uh, quickly the group went from honoring the newest Ravenel to questioning whether or not St. Julian was Thomas's son. Thomas, are you gonna do another paternal type test or no? Well, I mean, we did one, but the test was inconclusive. Thomas, like, I'm not gonna say you're manipulated or persuaded, but you wanna know people are telling the truth and you take them at face. But let's face it, it wouldn't be the first time she's told lies. Big time lies. Marissa from Madison, Wisconsin said, Craig, I thought you were on Catherine's side. I was disappointed to see you involved in that paternity talk. It sucked to see myself say that, but because Catherine was seeing someone at the time and that they continually said that they only had a one night stand that weekend, I said, statistically, maybe you would like to look further into this. And I hated that I said it, it's none of my business, but I was kind of just giving, you know, giving my opinion. Uh, Whitney, you were pretty silent during the paternity conversation. What were you thinking? I don't know. I mean, we all, we all had our doubts and questions. You know, Tom, I think Thomas did say the results were inconclusive. And so we're just like, hey, just find out for sure and that's it. Put Catherine, sure. what did you think about J.D., who is Kenzie's godfather, being the one Disgusted. to bring the topic up? Disgusted with all of it. So, Thomas, you had a third paternity test done, and you are definitely the father. Yes. Yes. It's my child. I'm sick of it being questioned, my, the paternity, the ethnicity. This is all very offensive. Well, you know None what? Of you guys understand. It, a lot of people don't, don't have to question these things. Like Patricia they, said, she they doesn't don't, know but anyone. people like you do to try to think I don't have like a me. child. No one's ever questioned exactly, the paternity. Exactly, so shut up until you do. Shut up. Why? I'm not allowed to have an opinion because I don't have children? That seems a that, bit harsh. I'm not playing nice girl anymore simply because you want to play nice girl. You've never played nice girl. You're out no, of your I, mind. No, I'm playing placating the crazies <laughs> because these people will not be held accountable. Then why do you want to be around us? Why do you want to be our friend? I don't want to be your friend, you dumbass.